Okay, this is for Algebra 2. It's the worksheet I just handed out that um, has long division and synthetic division. This is from page 2, number 1. And it wanted you to divide this polynomial right here by x minus 4. Remember when you do that, you're looking for some magic number right here that when you take it times this first term x, it would give you 6x squared. So hopefully you can see, let me see since I'm doing this myself, that that would be 6x because 6x times x gives you 6x squared. Okay, then you have to take the 6x times this negative 4, and that right there would give you a negative 24x. So I'm going to write that right there. And then remember, because you have to then subtract, when you subtract, you have to change the signs. So I'm going to make this a minus, and I'm going to make this a plus. <clears throat> so that's very important. Notice these are going to cancel. This is going to give you a negative 2x. And then bring down your next term like that. All right, so now we're looking for this next thing. What times x will give you this first term, negative 2x? Hopefully you can see that's a negative 2. And so a negative 2. Why? Because negative 2 times x gives you a negative 2x. Remember, you multiply these two together and write it down right here. Now you're going to multiply these two together. Negative 2 times a negative 4, that's a positive 8. So we're going to write that down right there. It's a positive 8. And then you change your signs. So combine them. These should always cancel. This is going to end up giving my, me a remainder of 4. So this right here is my remainder. The proper way to write that is right here. You're going to add always your remainder on. It's a 4 over whatever you're dividing by, x minus 4. If you want to be lazy and just write R4, you know, I'm okay with that. But that's how you do long division.